community. Maybe we can start there and then maybe some of the search engine guys can chime in. Yeah, I definitely think that um, social media really helps you build authority because the people that are your customers, they see you as a resource um, and they value the information you're providing them through social media. Because again, it's not push advertising where you're blasting a TV commercial to thousands of people who don't care. Um, you're you know, sending out a message to people who already care about you and who already feel like they're part of your community. So that in itself you know, gives you a lot of authority to um, direct your customers to do certain things if you want them to participate in the content if you have promotion. They're more likely to participate if they already have that relationship with you. Um, they're also more likely to purchase from you uh, when they do need your service. So again, people participating on your Facebook may not need your service right away, um, but when they think to book a flight, they're going to think, oh, you know, I'm going to go with uh, Southwest because I know that they've been updating me on Twitter, that they've given me uh, discounts on Twitter, so you're going to go with that because you already have that established relationship. Mm -hmm. And it's a, you know, it extends out, so a lot of what goes on Twitter is, is links get shared, right? People yeah. send, they break these links and they get retweeted out, which is, is going out there, and uh, those can be blogged about and become permanent links on the internet, and if they're timely and relevant and they're created by authoritative sites or users on sites, mm -hmm. Uh, those can really, really help in terms of uh, you know, driving relevance for that particular uh, link destination.